Bringing you the flavor of the Midlands. Live from Columbia, this is Soda City Live. Well, welcome back to Soda City Live. This weekend, a Midlands business will be featured on the Food Network. The owner of Embellished Dough Custom Cookies complete, competed rather for the network's Christmas Cookie Challenge and also had an opportunity to bring someone special with her. Joining me today to tell us all about it, uh, all about it rather, is owner of Embellished Dough, Selena Dennis, and her husband, Antavis Dennis. Did I say that right? Antavis? You did, yes. Thank you so much for joining me. We're excited. So this was the first year that they actually allowed spouses. So how, first of all, before we even get into that, mm -hmm. how did you get this opportunity or how did you find out about this? Um, so actually someone sent me a Instagram message. Um, it was weird, you know, you get a message and right. you're like, do you want to be, you know, try and get an opportunity to participate in this cookie challenge? And so I'm like, is this real? And so I followed up and went through a couple interviews. So, and it's funny because they reached out last year. Wow. I went through the first interview and I talked myself out of it. Oh, no. Yep. And then I didn't even tell him about it. Oh, he would have talked me into it. And so, um, but this year I was like, you know what, let me go for it. Because I felt I wasn't ready yet last year, but it was perfect because I probably wouldn't have had the opportunity to, for him to be on there with me. Right. So well, everything yeah. happens for a reason. That's exactly. So you That's found out that your husband could go with you. Yes. So how was that? Um, it was it was good. He set me at ease. Um, it was fun. We lived in the moment like we took it all in. So it was nice to have him there. And like I say, I probably my nerves probably wasn't as bad I think about having, that. you know, familiarity right. You know, right. right there with me. So I guess it could be kind of nerve wracking because I know sometimes when I watch the competitions and they're doing the countdown, you're like, oh, my gosh. Yeah. And I know <laughs> most of that is editing, but it kind of builds that suspense. <laughs> and so I couldn't imagine being somewhere and then having the nerves there and then having your husband there to kind of help to ease things out a little bit but did he get to did you get to bake anything uh yes you I did? did i actually got to bake a little <laughs> bit and it was definitely frightening for me oh, no. uh, but it was a great experience now we can't give too much away because no. this is going to be airing on sunday yes. at 8 p.m on the food network yes. so you have you do you help her in the kitchen at all with the current business uh, i help with tasting the cookies <laughs> absolutely you have the best job you have the best job yes. the yes. cookie tester that's it and you know we have a couple pictures of some of the cookies that you've made i mean it's so many so many different themes yeah. and we're there you have the macaroons there she also listen we'll talk about it after we go through some of these pictures but look at this look at these you do so you do birthdays baby showers Anything. all types of events all types and yes. where are you located or is it more like we're a cater? mobile yeah we're mobile based um in blythewood we have a little cookie camper and we're at Soda City usually every Saturday wow. so yeah they can always find us at Soda City in front of the Marriott you can't miss our little cookie camper so yeah listen I'm excited to try my cookies <laughs> and look how beautiful these cookies are so what what is your background I read a little bit on your website so you did this for church and it just turned into a it business I had no intentions of I've always I'm a creative so just like you say you were so I've always um, loved all things creative but and we love sweets too and I wanted to learn how to make sugar cookies. And I had this $29 course that I said I was going to purchase. I'm a little cheap. So I was looking if they had a coupon or something. They never did. So the church um, opportunity came about. And so I was like, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and purchase a course so I can make cross cookies for our prison's ministry. They were going to take some cookies to the um, prison. And so I went ahead and purchased a course. They didn't end up taking the cookies because something happened to the prison and they got no. shut down where you, we couldn't take them. But I still went ahead and started practicing post some pictures on Facebook. I thought they looked horrible. Somebody asked me to make cookies for her daughter's um, birthday party and it was bowling. I was just starting. We didn't have a cutter to, and I couldn't get it as quick. And he went online on YouTube to find out how you make it with wire, a, a bowling pin cookie cutter. So he made the wow. bowling pin cookie cutter. And that, and ever since then it was like, well, maybe it should be, you know, you should start a business. And he came up with a name and We've been going oh ever since goodness. then. Well, you know, yeah. so you you've been a lot more supportive than <laughs> right. just eating than the eating cookies. cookies. Yes. <laughs> and I also love the little color coordination you have yes. here. <laughs> um, I do want to show our viewers we're actually going to make cookies with um, Selena in just a few. But I want to show you what she brought us. Oh, my goodness. She brought the entire <laughs> the entire station has cookies with their faces on them. She has a, my headshot, my business card, one of the events that I've hosted. We have these. W-I-S cookies. I cannot wait. I'm going to have to turn this way. I cannot wait to try these. And they even, you even have your own little branding. Yes, you okay. stamp it with the branding <laughs> and some vanilla bean macaroons. I am not sharing. I have no intentions on sharing at all. Well, we, um, I'm just super excited for you all to be able to share not only your business, but 
to be able to share what it is that you do and enjoy with the nation, maybe yes. even international. Whoever has you access to the internet, <laughs> watch it, so this is going to be on the internet forever. And so <laughs> this, this is just the beginning, and I'm super excited for the both of you. Thank and you. I cannot wait to make cookies. So we're, we're not going to make the cookies. We're going to decorate them. So we'll be back with much more Soda City Live. Dondi and I are going to have an opportunity to decorate cookies of our own. We'll get some good tips, too. Yes. That's right. Much more Soda City Live <laughs> coming up after the break.